Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea for those of you who didn't know already. Today I'm gonna go ahead and be filming a get ready with me. Para cuando se vayan al baile, con el novio, o con quien sea que se vayan, con el Sancho. Just kidding, don't have Sanchos. I shouldn't be talking. Anyways, right! Um, and I'm gonna be also answering a few questions. I went ahead and put in my Instagram for you guys to ask me a couple of questions. So I'm gonna go ahead and start by priming my face. I use this hydrate. I, my mom bought it. Lo compró en TJ Maxx. And if my mom uses it, well, it must be good because my mom uses it. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Mia's right here behind the camera. So if you see me talking to somebody, it's me. I'm not talking to myself. Right. <laughs> so um, I just put a couple of drops on my face because, you know, I don't got a man to be putting. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. We not. Right, we're not gonna be talking about that right now. I don't know if y'all can see this ugly ass pimple. What the fuck is this? Anyways, my earrings are from Peter's shop. Make sure to go ahead and check them out. We, I am doing a giveaway with them. So one of you can win three pairs of earrings, so make sure to go ahead and check that out. So after I go ahead and prime my face, I, I go ahead and um start with my brows. So yeah, girl got new brushes or whatever. <laughs> So I'm gonna be using this Morphe one. They don't have numbers. Nada más es como el eye, el eye something set, like for your eyes. Cause, bro, I went to Dallas and I lost all my eye brushes. Don't ask me how, cause I don't know. And I'm gonna get mad all over again. But I just lost them, so I needed to buy new ones. So Mia, can you ask me the first question? Mia gonna be answering me the questions cause she don't be doing nothing else, so. First one is, what do you love but also dislike about yourself in general? What do I love and dislike about myself overall in general? No. Así, ¿verdad? Algo así? Yeah. Okay, me entendieron. That's the point. Any <laughs> um, I'm going to have to say what everybody going to say, and I think it's my body. Like, there's days where I'd be like, ooh, she thick. And then there's days where I'd be like, damn, I need to get in shape. But I think that's like, I mean, you know, like, I feel like I just don't show that sometimes I'm insecure about myself because y'all see me like she's super secure and this and that. But your girl be insecure sometimes. But it's okay. It's all stuff you got to work on. You're not going to be confident your full freaking life. You know what I mean? So I think that's one of my biggest, like, good and bad things about myself. But for my eyebrows, I'm using the e.l.f. medium. It's like a duo combo thingy but honestly if i was to recommend you one it would be the off pomade elf off y aquí cuando supe que la había cagado the elf pomade in the same shade that one's really good i just lost mine and i haven't bought another one because i'm doing okay with that one but the other one has a lot more pigment so i think i would definitely recommend the other one a lot more it's my first time using these brushes so it's gonna be a little bit more different you know Okay, so after I fillet my eyebrows, they're not clean. Yo, my eyebrows look trashy, okay, but we gonna fix them. <laughs> I need to do my eyebrows, I know. Um, I just haven't done them because I'd be lazy. But I'm gonna go ahead and use my LA Girl Concealer in the shade Cool Nude. This is my girl, my girl. Right. My go-to concealer, Um, I just got a little bit too light. So if I recommend one, I think it's called Medium Beige or something like that. And I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this Wet n Wild flat brush. They're like 99 cents at CVS or Walgreens. And they come in handy. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a poco normal, no sé por qué. Um, and I just go ahead and clean out the bottom of my eyebrow. Okay, Mia, next question. Okay. Next question. I'm finna fire you. Are you an only child? I love you so much and I'm a big fan of love. Am I an only child? I love you too. And yes, I am an only child. I mean, my dog kind of is a child too, you know, but. Just because you don't like my dog don't mean I don't love my dog, all right? Lola, fuck this hoe. She don't know what she's talking about. Be like, just because you don't be laying that way, gordo and shit. Bro, me over here hating on my dog or something. Like, she always fucking yelling at her and shit. Like. 
Anyways, yes, I am an only child. Well, from my mom. With my dad, I have more brothers and sisters. So the concealer that I use under my eye, I go ahead and drag it with a concealer brush. I used to use the Morphe one, but I actually started using this one from, I think it's from Zoeva. Something like that. And I actually like it a lot more than the Morphe one. I think you can get these online. Vienen como en paquetes también. And that one is my go-to brush right now for my concealer. Next question. Do you think Chema looks like a kid without a beard? Somebody said, do you think Chema looks like a kid without a beard? Hell yeah, Chema, I don't know what the heck you did to your face. Why you over here shaving and shit? You look like you 12. You know why Looking like Elvis twin and shit. You know why he shaved it? Why? Because he told his sister to fix it, and then he said that she fucked it up and cut half, so he just... That was bzoop. But I'm going to go ahead and be using my Morphe 3502. Oh, it's literally the letter O. Two. And well, it's one of my favorite palettes, as you can see. <laughs> as y'all can see, my palette broke as fuck, just like me. Use my discount code. Just kidding, I don't got one. Psych, you fell for it. Anyways, so I'm going to go ahead and be grabbing this Morphe brush. It's just like a crease brush. And I'm going to go ahead and be grabbing this shade right over here, the first one, with this one right here. So I'm going to go ahead. I said ho. God trying to tell me something. <laughs> Put this on my crease. I cannot talk today. Um. Okay, Mia, next question. Next question is... Who taught you how to dance? Who taught me how to dance? My boyfriends. Aha! No, I'm just kidding. Aha! Aha! <laughs> no. Um, my homeboys taught me. I started dancing like a year and a half ago. Like, towards the end of, you can say my junior year. A year and a half, two years ago. Yeah, that's when I really started dancing. Like, I started going to Chapa, but they closed Chapa down. I used to go to Chapa. Bro, I used to stay at O1 every weekend. What is this concealer? Anyways, we're not gonna worry about that. Why didn't y'all tell me I had this on my face? Rude. All like they can tell me, right? Right. So um, that's when I really started dancing. But bro, I could not dance before. Like I was a stiff ass motherfucker. Like looking like I'm dancing a waltz and shit. Like I used to be stiff. But I think what really made me smooth, not finna cap, was Damien. Cause like. I remember the first time I went to, like, like the first first time I hanged out with Damien was last year, I think in like September. Like when I went to Dallas, like I went to his house and I had already told him like, can you teach me how to spin? So my first time going to Hadi, like he helped me a little bit, you know, like practice or whatever. So that's really how like I started to really learn how to spin. I still don't know how to spin like perfectly, but my posture has gotten a lot better because if I'm going to be honest with you, like a lot of your dancing has to do with your posture. Because if you got like, like, you could be smooth, but if you, could be smooth, but if you have a bad posture, like it don't look right. I think it's really about your posture. And what a lot of guys do is como yo soy chaparrita, like guys tend to do this, like se joroban así y no se ve bien, like that's why when I, I was dancing with my homeboy, I'm not finna expose him, right? I had and now, he's a little bit taller than me, so I was like, like, le enderece la espalda because estaba así. And I'd be like, just because I'm shorter than you doesn't mean you have to, like, bend down. Like, as long as I'm at your chin or something, like, we good. But homeboys don't want to be the cachete, cachete. You don't have to be the cachete, cachete. I promise it doesn't look ugly, okay? And then don't put your whole arm around the guy. Like, don't. It just, no, man. Like... So I actually changed my hand posture. I changed it so now I have it right here with the guy not at their neck, and I feel like it helps me a lot more with spin. Be like, like, Hell yeah, I feel like I'm on. slipping, yeah. and here I can just like grab the guy, you know. So I'd be chilling. Um, and be patient, like you're not gonna learn right away. I promise. Like I'm barely learning my fast spins. I'm not really good at fast spins yet, but I mean everything takes time and practice. You're not gonna be like perfect since the beginning. What made you start a YouTube channel? What well, made um. To be honest, my Instagram. So what really made me start my YouTube channel? I think people saw my lives and how I would talk on live. And they would be like, why don't you make a YouTube channel? And I'd be like, like I'm kind of shy. Because on live, like, bro, if you know me, I be talking out of my ass. <laughs> like, I just talk and talk and talk. And so, like, people like that because I guess I'm not shy or whatever. Anyways, that's what really got me into my YouTube and stuff like that. So, 
Yerp. You guys, thank you. So if I become famous, I'm going to cash out each one of you $5. Stupidy. Anyways, I went ahead and grabbed this color right here and this one right here. And I went ahead and mixed those to darken up my crease. Look at her talking like a M U A. People ask me about my chain. Look. <clears throat> Anyways, we finna conceal our chest too, you know, contour your titties. Just kidding. I don't know. My concealer be going everywhere. My concealer and my powder, you finna catch these holes everywhere. So I went ahead and grabbed those two colors to go ahead and deepen up my crease, okay? So. See, I saw like playa. See, I playa. ¿Cuál prefieres? Houston, Dallas, or Austin? Ah, uh -uh, they not finna do me like that. <laughs> ¿Cuál prefiero? Houston, Dallas, or Austin? <sighs> hey, who asked that? I'm finna fight them. Um, Roxy Aragon. Okay, sis, you asked a good question. Yeah. You deserve an award. Dang! Why y'all do this to me? My friend's gonna be mad. Bro, Devin be asking the dumbest things, bro. I swear. If she has some stupid ass question, I'm not finna answer that. And I'm gonna smack her tomorrow or at her party Saturday. And that's all God. Okay, I can't find my brush. Somebody stole it. Why are you stealing my sheet? <laughs> How did I even get concealer there? Anyway. Anyways. Okay, for Houston. Houston got the daddy. Nah. <laughs> right, no. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, we're not going to talk about that. Anyways, um, right. Um, so we're going to use this other brush from a Morphe collection. Stupid ass, no Morphe collection. Como que si yo la hice. Anyways. Nah, Houston just got some of my favorite dancing partners. So when it comes to dancing. Not Houston. Houston just got my favorite dancing partners. So let's see. Dallas. Dallas, Dallas just be lit, bro. I'll be like, you know, like, I'll be like, anthro type of shit over there. Like, when I'm in Dallas, yo me suelto así. Yo me suelto y rumba se. Bro, I'm a whole different person over there. Like, I'll be wild. How do you be going crazy? How do you, bro? Pongo yo Stupid, no, I don't. But, bro, what kind of a pongo I don't know. I'm finna make a remix out of that whole thing. <laughs> Anyways, so I don't know. That is just be lit, you know. And I have some cool ass friends over there. But then Austin, my bits are there, and I be getting crunk over there too. Like my friends are lit, you know. But they're more calm lit, you know. Yeah. So, but if I had to pick a city, damn, I'm gonna have to pick Dallas. Because, bro, I be lit. I be crook. Like, I like best dick. Ma'am, somebody that. asked best dick. I know. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> um, I've never had a sexual interaction in my life. I highly believe um, boys ain't worth my time. Next question. Next question. But anyways, if y'all really want to know, it was. Right. Right. Y'all not finna right. know. That's for me to know, for y'all to find out. But I think he knows. Mom, if you're watching this, I'm just kidding. No es cierto, mami. Yo nunca he hecho esas cosas en mi vida. So, si está viendo esto, alguien le fue de chismosa, pero yo no ando haciendo cosas malas. Yo no, 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 no podría. Next question, Winter. Has your mom caught you fucking? Has my mom caught me fucking? You must be really dumb if you think I'm going to be doing that coochie coochie up in my house. <laughs> but now my mom has it. So... Right. Anyways, no, ma'am. If somebody really want to get in that, dive in that shit, tell them to take you to a hotel. I mean, shit. But only if you're 18 plus. And don't be going with any guy, okay? Because these guys going to be kidnapping you and shit. So, anyways, if a guy really want it, make a boyfriend. Don't be, make him, you know, spend a little money or something. Take you out to eat or something. Don't just give yourself out like that. Bro, I'm not giving good advice. Don't listen to me, okay? Next don't have sex question. until you're married right right <laughs> and bro you gotta make sure that boy know how to change a tire at least know how to do something so don't just give me give up your kitty kitty to anybody i i life lesson life Next lesson <laughs> but no my mom hasn't caught me to answer the question <laughs> favorite dancing partner this one gonna hurt but my favorite dancing partner period is shopping sorry not sorry Really? Like, I had really thought about that. Bro, yes. And I messed up my craze. Look at this. Really? 
Yes. Okay, look. It's cause like, bro, Chapin can dance anything. Okay, from Houston is Chapin. Sorry, 2K is my other favorite. So it's between 2K and Chapin. Yeah, oh, and Chema. I like, those are my top three from Houston. Hello, people don't be hurt. I know y'all finna be hurt. I promise. I like, I'm sorry, but those are just the guys that dance the most with me. And like, okay, so it's gonna be top one is Chema. Chema, Chapin. Chapin, 2K, then Chema. Because I really like how Chema moves his, like, he moves his hands when he does that. So it looks smooth. So I'm going to go ahead and be grabbing this glitter from Benny Beauty, I believe. I got it a couple years ago. So I'm going to Beauty Queen. Shout out to Beauty Queen. She does great work. Check her out on Instagram. I'll go ahead and put her Instagram right here down below. But make sure to go ahead and check her out. She does some bomb ass looks. And if y'all ever need somebody to beat your face, get sis. Because she's the best at it here in Houston. How's school and what are you studying for? How's school and what am I studying for? Um, school has been good. It's a little bit stressful, but you know you gotta do what you gotta do to get. No es que salir de la de la vida esta. Yo no quiero ser pobre, entonces ya tengo que ponerme a trabajar y estudiar y hacer algo con mi vida. No andar nada más de pinche callejera todo el tiempo. Anyways, um, it's good though. It's a bit stressful, but I think at the end of the day, we all know that school is worth it and it'll benefit you at the end. And I'm almost done. I have like two months left. See, you get it? And your girl will be done with classes and off to externship. Favorite DJ and why? Favorite DJ. DJ Manchas, baby. Um. Anyways, um, it's a, it's definitely gonna be DJ Manchas. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and go with the same palette, and I'm gonna go ahead and grab this color right here, and right here. And mixing those up for the outer part of my eye. But I think it has to be DJ Manchas because... Not because he was the first DJ to make me a special guest. But I feel like he's so humble and like... No es presumido. I mean, I'm not saying que otros DJs son presumidos. Pero siempre, he's always been so humble. And siempre me ha abierto las puertas a mí. And like, he's always... Me ha apoyado en todo. And he's always been there for me. And I think like... That's why he's one of my favorites. I'm like, I think he's the best because, bro, he just, he don't care. And he's late and he's cool. I like him. So, I think DJ Montrez is definitely my favorite. Favorite song to dance with who? Bro, there's this um, Tribal and Wapango mix on SoundCloud. Bro, me and me will be going off in the car. We'll be like, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And like we just be going, oh, I have it right here. Look, let me see. I'm going to try and show y'all. But, bro, and like, but right now, my favorite song, Is it this? right now, it has to be El Amor de Mi Vida. Hey, 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 hey. And it's by DJ Saucy. Saucy, Saucy. So that's one of my. Okay, you can come here. Oh, we're on our way to dance with people. Okay, but my favorite song, <laughs> my favorite song to dance right now is by Conjunto Renacer, El Amor de Mi Vida. Make sure to go check it out. My boy Arturo sings that song. Put that song right now. Please stop being shit, guys. She be acting like she don't like that song. I smell, I smell cat. DJ, póngame la canción, DJ. Uy, uy, Mari, póngame la canción, chica. Quiero escuchar el amor de mi vida. Wait, wait, come here, because I gotta play my favorite part. Ready, ready? I know what you're Karaoke night, baby. Contigo quiero estar mil años más. Déjame ser. Ok, ya, ya, que se me emocione me... Para contrataciones, llámenle a mi manager mía ¡Todo iré! También, con momentos felices So, after I put those two colors out of my uh, outer corner No puedo hablar, como pueden ver Voy a agarrar mi Jacqueline Hill palette Ya llegó el chupito Ya llegó el desmadre Y al que no le guste Pues ya saben so I'm gonna go ahead and grab this brown color right here and this one right here and gonna go ahead and put that in my outer corner as well to go ahead and darken up the outer corner. For sure, for sure. Outer corner, yeah, this is what it's called. So I'm gonna grab this wet and wild 
brush. It's like a, it's pretty much like a blending brush, but it's un poquito más dura. So you can have a little bit more control. And I'm going to go ahead and put that just in the outer parts of my eye to darken it up. Noche me preguntaron qué pasó con tu cariño. Y les contesté la neta. Talk about how you gained the following. Talk about how I gained what? Like followers. So, my followers. I honestly get this asked a lot. Like, what did you do? So, I pretty much danced. That's really it. And I think what really got to people is my confidence about how I don't care in that way or whatever. I want wherever I want, whenever I want. And I think that's pretty much what really caught people's attention. And I mean, I don't think I'm that bad of a dancer. So, that's what really got people into... I guess you can say my Instagram. I really didn't do much, just dance and take pictures and stuff. So I want to thank each and everyone that supports me. My page has grown immensely in a year. Gracias a Dios, mi página ha crecido como 25 mil seguidores. Hace un año tenía nada más mil seguidores. Y mi página creció inmensamente. Y le quedan muchas gracias a todos por apoyarme y estar aquí. Por los que han estado aquí por mucho tiempo y también por los que han estado aquí un poco de tiempo. Les quedan muchas gracias. Gracias a Dios he mandado muchas oportunidades y experiencias por los seguidores que tengo y nada más les quiero dar muchas gracias por eso. First time you went clubbing. First time I went clubbing. I'm never gonna forget. So the first time I went clubbing, it, I was with my BFF Salma and then I was with Joanna. And so um, it was some, I think Salma was having like a family party or something like that. You know, entonces eran en un hall y me acuerdo que era en blue. I think it's called blue. I had that one or something like that. And so she was having a family party, and we were like, "What if we go to Escape?" And I think I I said I think the entrance is free. It wasn't free, my dumbass. I had never gone to a club, so I didn't know. So then I was like, um, "Let's go." So we went, and then. And I remember what I was wearing. I was wearing a red dress. And I remember I was like, damn, I've never, like, it was my first time going to a club. And I remember I had so much fun. And after that, bro, I became addicted. So, so I'm going to go ahead and use my two foundations. I first applied the Wood and Wild Photo Focus in the shade Golden Honey. So, I do recommend whenever you do get this foundation to go ahead and grab one a little bit darker. It does get a little bit, it's a little bit light on the skin. Um, so make sure whenever you do get it, you get one a little bit darker than your shade just in case. And then I use the Hard Candy Glamouflage Full Coverage Foundation in the shade 1511. This is, I love this foundation, bro. My mom introduced me to it. She was using it once and I was like, me la presta. And she was like, yep, y me la presto. And sis, me um, toda la noche, especially when I use the powder. So make sure you bake your face. But that one's like my go-to foundation right now. Vamos a bailar a lo que está perro. ¿Cuántos años tienes? ¿Cuántos años tengo? Si, sí, ¿cuántos me miro? Just kidding. Tengo 15. ¡Ah! 15. ¡Ah! Me quisiera. Right. Tengo 19. Si Dios quiere, voy a cumplir 20 el 12 de enero. Ya voy a cumplir 20. Ya voy a estar bien, cabrón. You know. That's freaking pendo. Anyways. So, ya, ya voy a cumplir 20 en enero, si Dios quiere. Son unos meses, creo que es como en cuatro meses. Uh, de regalo, por si, ah, por si las dudas, ¿verdad? Me usan los anillos. Pinche con James Avery. Quiero uno en mi pinky, son un size 6. Y en mi thumb son un size 10. So, si me quieren agarrar uno de esos ahí, no, no se crean. Um, Tomás, brochas, nah, just kidding. Pero si, sí, uh, voy a cumplir 20. A lo mejor me hago un, un como dicen en el lejo, un pachangón, un pachangón. Pero no sé todavía qué me quiero hacer. A lo mejor me hago algo chiquito con mis amigos. Siempre iba algo chiquito, ¿verdad? Pero tengo como 20 mil amigos en Dallas, en Houston y en Austin. Imagínense cómo se va a hacer eso. Pero ya, ya casi cumplo los 20. So, voy a agarrar una brocha, esta rapita, y nada más voy a limpiar lo que es arriba de mis cejas con el lipstick foundation y no me lo voy a limpiar a pico. y me voy a poner mis pestañas y voy a hacer lo que es mi frente y voy a regresar a pico. so I went ahead and applied my lashes off camera and finished up my forehead after that I'm gonna go ahead and grab that same concealer the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade cool nude nude they say okay nice question 
Favorite place to eat. Favorite place to eat. Favorite place to eat. Dick. No, I'm just kidding. Um. Hmm. I don't know. I don't think I have a favorite place to eat. I like Wingstop. Wingstop and Pluckers and Tacos and. Jugaba con carritos de madera. Pa' un buen juguete. No vea de veras. El día 25 de diciembre. En su arbolito. No vea sorpresa. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and conceal the bottom of my eye. Can you see the water burger? On both sides. Bro, water burger hit the spot today. Because I haven't had that shit in a long time. So after concealing that, I'm gonna go ahead and bake my eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and use my air spun first in the shade translucent. Recommend 10 out of 10 for show, for show, for show. Let me take this. Can you blend this into my skin or something? Because I got concealer everywhere. Yeah, where do you think you're going? Let me fix my hair. What happened? No my questions. I can't see it. DJ, ¿qué pasó con la música, chica? So I'm gonna go ahead and make my under eye. I apply this in my under eye first right here. Arreglaba carros allá en Culiacán. A todos la hacía menos arrugada. Porque la mecánica... In my forehead, because... See, there's nothing worse than dancing with a guy and your makeup transferring into his shirt. I promise there's nothing worse than that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab my Maybelline powder, the one I always use as well in the shade light medium, and I'm gonna pack that over the airspawn powder that I have on already. En la clase del maestro es el que manda. Pongan atención si quieren aprender. So after that, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my same Jaclyn Hill palette. Don't pull out of la coca. Chica, just kidding. Don't do coke, that is bad for you, okay? Don't do drugs, I right, promise. I don't do drugs. I tend to recommend living a great lifestyle without drugs in my life. <laughs> right. I'm going to go ahead and grab this brush right here. It's staying from the same Morphe collection. I'm just going to go ahead and be grabbing just any brown that you want. Depends how dark you want your bottom eye to look. I like my eye to look dark, you know, like smoky top sheet. So just grab any dark color that you have and apply that to your bottom lower eye part area section whatever you want to call it lower lash line right that's what i made i'm gonna go ahead and grab this morphe eye brush it's like a little hold up it's like pointy-ish and that makes sense you see focus on this thanks so so i can just go ahead and blend that under my eye Y el por ti, que la de mi corazón, y el por ti. But, bro, siempre que hago, me maquillo, mi cabeza va más para abajo, más para abajo, yo no sé por qué. So, then, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the same brush, la misma brochita así, pero más chiquitita por lo que pueden ver. Y voy a dar un, un negro y lo voy a poner lo que es, like, the little, the little lining part of my eye like the lower 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 lash like the lash lash like to just go ahead and darken on my eye as you can see anyways voy a agarrar esta broche brocha brocha quita ya no sé que quise decir ahí what but and i'm gonna go ahead and buff the bottom shit. and i look fucking ugly in the back pues así estás mía sorry oh, just kidding i love you okay so we're gonna keep baking a little bit and i'm gonna go ahead and grab my Morphe bronzer in the name Debutante. Debutante. And I was Debutante, and I was like, I felt like, oh, no. Anyways, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Y voy a agarrar cualquier brush. Mi brocha está quebrado, okay? Se me quebró, mira, 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 mira. Pero es mi brocha favorita, solo la voy a tirar. Se me quebró porque no sé, pero se me quebró. Ya llevo años con ella, pero es mi brocha favorita para broncear. So, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And we're going to go ahead and slim these cheeks down because I wasn't born with a skinny face, baby. Dime por qué se fue si la adoré. Contéstame, amiga Soledad. Si algo le faltó, no fue. Okay, so we finna grab this Fit Me powder again. And we're going to cut the cheeks. You know, make you look slim, they go whatever. Anyways, bro, 
if you were just born slim thick you blessed so la cagué como siempre nunca se pone en este pinche polo en los carretes de marrana flaca Brand new whip, ice in a bag of chips. Now I can see why these basic hoes piss. Yeah, that that's my type. Okay, so after that, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some chapstick because. Just because. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> um, because I always apply chapstick first. I don't know why. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this new Morphe brush. I'm gonna use this one for my nose. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and try it out today. I ever see my gusta. It's from the eye set, too. Right, I'm gonna use my highlight. And I don't have any more and I forgot I broke it. <laughs> right. Anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and use my Anastasia Nicole Guerrero. It is broke, sis. Like, broken, like. Así de roto está mi corazón. Right. So, I'm going to go ahead and use that. I'm going to wet my brush. I'm just using any. It's water. I promise it's not setting spray. It's water. Because. Or well, maybe it is setting spray. I don't know, bro. I'm going to be mixing up these bottles and stuff. So, voy a grab ese. Y me voy a poner. Pues no puedo escoger un color, ¿verdad? Porque ya están todos mezclados, so. I'm thinking if I like this brush. I said for my nose, that is my cheek. <laughs> right, okay, we're going to do the nose for So. Mm, I think I'm going to just stick to my regular brush. It's a little bit too hard. So I'm going to go ahead and be using my Morphe in the number M451. I think everybody pretty much recommends the same Morphe brush. I recommend this one for sure, 10 out of 10. Um, I think it needs your cheeks and highlight looking smooth. So, I learned that not to apply too much, like, pressure. I used to, like, pop the freaking brush on my cheeks, and you're not supposed to do that. So, my questions aren't loading anymore, so... We're not answering any more questions. Sorry, ya se acabó la entrevista. Sorry, ya se se me estaban emocionando, pero so we had some exclusive content we could not talk about. Stupid. Eh? So then I'm gonna grab this Morphe brush in the number M four three nine. Badass brush. And I'm gonna just clean this up right here. Say I don't dance now. I make money move. Say I don't gotta dance. I make money move. And then for my lips. I'm going to go ahead and be using the NYX lingerie in the number 40 or the shade Ruffle Trim. Pensaba que te había olvidado, pero pusieron la canción. And after that, I'm going to go ahead and be grabbing the NYX matte shade in the shade um Stockholm is my go-to nude. Bro, you might want to be like, I'm not a chiquita. I just be like, so after that, I'm gonna go ahead and right, grab this Anastasia lip gloss in the shade Venus and apply that a little bit on top. So this is the completed look. Let me know what you guys think on the comments down below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Most importantly, let me know what you guys want to go ahead and see in the comments down below. And we go ahead and recreate this look. Go ahead and tag me. I'm going to go ahead and put my Instagram right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a blessed day. Os quiero mucho.